Hey, what's up, guys? In today's video, we're we'll going be painting the Mach 1. Before the video gets started, go ahead, subscribe, comment, and uh, like this video. Now, technically, the car has already been painted. I'm filming this intro after the fact. I'm going to go ahead and run you through everything we did. In the morning, we got it taped off. We sanded down anything else that needed to be sanded off and washed the car. Now, the color we painted the car is avalanche gray. They put the same color on the uh, the Shelby GT350s and I thought it looked great on the Mach 1 and as you'll soon see it does. So with that out of the way, hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay guys, the car's been drying for a while here and we're going to show you how it turned out. It's been drying for about 20 minutes I'd say and the more it dries the more it smooths out and gets more glossy. Now here on the hood, it's not as glossy as we would have hoped because we were running out of paint but the hood will be getting the, uh, the black stenciled uh, Mach 1 hood eventually. The paint we used here was the uh, 2016 uh, Ford Avalanche Gray. They put this color on the Shelby's, the Raptors, and I just think it's going to look great on this car, especially for the look we're going for. So here's the plan. I found some measurements on the internet and it'll tell me where I can position this decal. I'm going to try to follow those measurements best I can and hopefully it turns out looking good. I haven't applied a lot of decals before so this is a learning experience for me and hopefully I can teach you guys how you to do it too. Alright, now I'm going to let it sit there for about a minute or two, let this wax paper on top kind of get a little dry, then I'll slowly peel the backing off. Well, there it is and it looks great. Now, a little tip, after you lay these decals, you're not going to want to power wash the car or anything. I'd let them sit for a couple days, make sure they bond to the paint. You might even sit the car out in the sun. Now, I just have a whole other car to do. Well guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I for one think the car looks great. I'm really liking how it's turning out. But this car is far from done. We still have to do a lot of work on the interior. 
and the motor needs some work still. So, stay tuned, and I'll see you guys next time.